what's good and welcome back my fishing planet players they have finally give us an update for fishing planet and the three main topics are clubs really mechanism and a landing keep net i feel like there's more around but the more we play the more we figure out things so in today's video i'll be covering a few topics in this one and uh if i haven't they'll be uploaded in other video so for starters we are going to talk about the club First, you can create your own or you can join someone else's. It's pretty simple, I haven't shown how to create it, but once you go into the game, head to the club options and you're going to be seeing everything you can do. Some things will be for Bay coins because you have a more customized photo or a more customized frame. Once you guys get there, it will all be there and it's very simple to do it. Also, you can receive requests from players who want to join or you can do it manual by yourself go to the clan or the club select the name press invite and invite friends from a list that already been friends with on playstation and that's pretty much it guys nothing hard to it so those players who have joined basically your club mate they can send message from a different lobby different session or while they're in the main menus you can also respond here when you pause the game but they don't have to do that. In a minute, I'll also demonstrate that while you're fishing, you can also respond there because you have the option right on the spot to reply back as fast as possible. If you're on a fish, you're too busy or just driving around on the map. You can also see baits that you can share and the markers that a friend requests. However, once you do this, there is a cooldown time for some reason for you to do it again. And I'm not sure why that's a thing, but they need to fix that or I might be doing it wrong. But as you guys can see, there's a cooldown on the thing that I've just sent to a friend, a marker. So hopefully they fix that. Now I'm in a lobby and to the far left corner, you're going to be seeing the tabs open. As you guys can see, Zach, Unify Fishing and Friends. Friends are the original lobby that was there before with everyone typing, saying nice one, catching the fish and you see them. Unify Fishing is a club. So I can respond back to my club mate and they can also send messages over to me as well. And Zach, that's a person to person message in the chat. So only you can see it and the person who is receiving it can see it. So new options to get used to and to know the function. Now we're adding to the settings to enable our landing net. This is where you put a net into the water, get the fish to be in it and to lift them out of the water with you know a little bit ease it's not necessary to use this net but it's something new to do you know so how to use a landing net is once the fish is in 10 feet of water they're going to give you the option to press x and hold the keep net which is going to send the keep net in the water to scoop the fish in and if the water is too deep they will also tell you you can also manually turn the keep net with the right unlock stick i'm not sure what it is on xbox and pc but you can adjust to where the fish is at to get them in the keep net. It's a little bit wonky at first, but overall using it, you guys will get used to it. However though, you don't have to use it. As you guys can see, you have a option in the settings to turn it on and off if you don't like it. I found out that this landing net is much easier to use when you're at water level or the level where the fish is at. It's really easy to scoop them in and to get them catched. Also, if something is in the way of the fish, the landing net will give you a option that something is in the way and you can't use it to get the fish in. In a couple of videos ahead of this, I will show that demonstration. Now over to the reeling mechanism, which is the pump and reel. That's how I call it because that's how I say it. It's pretty straightforward. You pump up, you reel down to get the slack line and it does work. However, you guys don't have to do this because it's pretty much the same as before just a different way to get a fish in i can't confirm that the fish get tired while you're fighting it this way but i haven't seen any difference between them so the way i see it is just another way to reel in a fish and to get creative you can still hold the l2 button and the r2 button which is the hook set and the reel button to get a fish in wait for the opportunity for him to stop run and to get the line in it's pretty much the same thing in my opinion hopefully that explanation was straightforward because it is 
now I'm gonna add over to XP and max drag so the XP I'm talking about is the XP you get from fishing with your club mates in a club room they have just recently added a new room to fish with only club members and you can also make XP judging on how many players are in the lobby or should I say club mates are in the lobby and how you get in them so you got tackle modifier barbless bonus and I think there's another option let me see in a minute got it it's club mates so the way to see these XP is the old triangle to show or add XP moderators it's right there below the XP bar on the screen I will put a arrow there so you got tackle modifier which is from line real barbless bonus spoons jigheads you know those barbless items and clubmate xp is from how many persons are in the lobby fishing with you now the max drag which i think is the most dangerous part of this update unfortunately no more max drag even when you have the space to go that high and when you do go max drag if you guys look at the right corner where you see the three meters line rod and reel you will see a red circle going around the icon basically that gives you enough time to respond to correct your mistake and you guys can also tell from the meters that go in red as well the original meters you can also tell by them going to the red zone that something is going to break and i've noticed that it only affect the line on the rod but not the reel so be careful not to max drag your equipment turn them down before you go fishing and don't forget so guys hopefully those pointers i have covered the club the net and the really mechanism including other stuff like xp friends and lobby and so on can be helpful to you guys to understand how this update work as well i might be also trying out new things and learning new things so if i do i'll update you guys on it but for now hopefully this video can help you guys so y'all stay safe and i'll see you guys in the next one Yo, hold up, wait a minute, did you drop a like and subscribe to the channel as yet? Oh hell no, if not, now is the time to do so.